pressure is mounting on Linda Katehi to resign as Chancellor of UC Davis. Today, California's Lieutenant Governor called on her to step down. It is yet another setback for Linda Katehi and her efforts to return as Chancellor of UC Davis. Lieutenant Governor Gavin Newsom is the latest and most high profile politician to call for her resignation. Newsom released a statement Thursday saying it's time for Katehi to step down. On Wednesday, UC President Janet Napolitano called on Katehi to resign. Katehi refused and vowed to fight on to keep her position as UC Davis Chancellor. By Wednesday night, Napolitano ordered Katehi to take a leave of absence and ordered an investigation into Katehi and her controversial activities as Chancellor. Also on Wednesday, the union representing 22,000 UC employees called for a top-to-bottom investigation of all UC Davis administrators. Union spokesman Todd Stenhouse on the CBS 13 News at 6 o'clock. We've seen a couple of instances where we had administrators who are paid exorbitant sums of money uh, to work full-time for the university who are in turn moonlighting, uh, doing outside endeavors. How many of them? Uh, I will say more, more than two. With the UC Davis administration under fire, Ralph Hexter, a former provost and now acting chancellor, met with reporters Thursday. I think that the chancellor is herself at this point clear that only an investigation will, um, as she expects it, will clear her name. Noticeably out of sight from the cameras on this Thursday, Linda Katehi, who remains in seclusion in a desperate fight to save her job, and Janet Napolitano, who, behind closed doors, is now overseeing the investigation and who may soon be searching for the next chancellor to run UC Davis. Katehi is under investigation for accepting hundreds of thousands of dollars for sitting on boards of private companies and for reportedly overseeing an effort to erase unfavorable news stories about her and UC Davis from the Internet.